Are you black? Don't look down on me, don't look down on me, don't look down on me. Don't look down on me, don't look down on me, don't look down on me. Hey, oh, I am blessed. What about you? Let me hear you sing it. If you are blessed there, come on, sing it. Hey, welcome to this program this afternoon again. Some people say you are poor, you don't have money this don't look down on yourself because you are blessed you are specially created come on oh my god don't look down on yourself and don't allow anybody to look down on you you have some great potential in your life you're gonna make it my brother i declare to you you are blessed come on now. don't look down on me don't look down on me don't look down on me don't look down on me, don't look down on me, don't. Yes, I am blessed. And I believe you are blessed too. Glory be to God. Glory be to Jesus. Glory be to Messiah for have given us that spiritual gift even before we were born. God has deposited great potential in you. You are not created useless. There is a special reason why God has sent you to this world. You are sent to the world to accomplish God's given vision in your life. Obstacles may arise, but the destiny broke bro, bro, destiny blockers will be uprooted out of your life. And so I have come this afternoon. Yes, I have come this afternoon to encourage you. Don't look down on yourself. And never you allow anybody to look down on you because you also you are special before god almighty let's go again don't look down on me don't look down on me don't look down on me come on don't look down on me don't look down on me don't look down on me oh i am blessed hey i am blessed oh i am blessed i am blessed if you are blessed take up your dancing shoe over there let's go some people say some people say you are a poor man, you got no job. Don't look down on me, don't look down on me, don't look down on me. Hey, don't look down on me, don't look down on me, don't look down on me. Oh, come on, lift up your hand and sing it. I am blessed. This is prophetic song for you. Receive it this afternoon. Come on now. Hey, come on. Hey, some people say I be poor, I no get money. They call me names. They say I'll be cool, but up. Look down on me, don't look down on me, don't look down on me. Oh, let me hear you. Sing it. Shout it. Sing it. Shout it. Look down on me, don't look down on me, don't look down on me. Don't look down on yourself, my brother or oh, my sister. Come on, uh. hey, oh. let me hear you sing it. Come on, uh. come on, come on. Hey, yes, you are blessed. You are blessed, children of light, miracle child, destiny child. You are blessed. Join me to open the book of Hebrews, chapter 13, from verse. Um, let me read from verse 5. Your life should be free from the love of money, be satisfied with what you have. For he himself has said, I will never leave you or forsake you. Therefore, we may boldly say, Therefore, we may boldly say, The Lord is my helper. The Lord is my shepherd. I will not be afraid. What can man do to me? Remember your leaders who have spoken God's words to you as you carefully observe the outcome. Verse 8, Jesus Christ is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Don't be led astray by various kinds of strange teachings. My brother, Jesus Christ remained the same yesterday, today, and forever. That is the reason why you are blessed. That is 
because he remained the same. That is why you should put your trust in him because what he did to the people of old, he can do the same in your life. Hebrews 13 verse 8 says, Jesus remained the same yesterday, today, and forever. He is the same God who raised the death. Everything that is dead in your life, Jesus can resurrect it. Jesus can bring it back to life. Everything Satan has destroyed in your life, Jesus Christ, my Savior, your Savior, can heal you totally and give you total restoration. So, his power and his efficacy has never changed. In fact, the power of yes. The same Jesus Christ who empowered the apostles of all and released the supernatural anointing into their life and they went out doing good like their master Jesus Christ is still the same. Jesus changed not. He remained the same. He remained the savior of the world. He remained the architect of your destiny. He remained your father and your Lord and your creator. So don't have any doubt in him. No matter the situation that you are passing through, I am telling you cast all your burden unto him. He has the power and the ability to turn around your life. He remained the same yesterday, today and forever. He changed not. He is omnipotent. His words remain the same. He has never changed. He is not like you and me who changes like chameleon. My Jesus remain the same. And so I want you to develop absolute faith in him because he is the manufacturer of your life. Your destiny in his hands. Yes. Everything you will achieve in life before you were born is at his fingertips. And so he has destined your life for greatness. Why do you doubt him? Why do you remain so, 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 so sad in times of challenges of life? My Jesus Christ is still the same. His power, his efficacy, the power in his hands and his life is still able to solve your problem. He's able. He's an omnipotent God. Everywhere he went, he was doing good. Look at all the miracles he performed during this earthly ministry. He turned water into wine. What a miracle. No one can do it. Hey, he walked on the sea. Oh, come on. Who else can do that? He even asked Peter, his son, to try it. Peter walked on the, on the sea, on, the, on water. Oh, my God. He calmed. He commanded the storm to be still and the storm still. That storm in your life was still today. When you have faith in him, my Jesus, change it not. Look at that woman with the issue of blood. The woman suffering from hemorrhage for over 12, 12 years. He touched the garment of Jesus Christ. And instantly, that hemorrhage ceased. That is the Jesus Christ I'm talking about. He changed it not. Oh my God. Look at Jesus Christ who raised Lazarus from death. Look at Lazarus, the brother of Lazarus' body. That body was already getting rotten. And when Jesus got there, Mary and Martha said, Oh, what is Master coming to do here again? The body is getting rotten. Oh my Jesus. Jesus went to the tomb and called the name of Lazarus. And Lazarus rose. That is the Jesus Christ I am talking about. He remained the same yesterday, today, and forever. Oh my God. Look at that blind man. Jesus spit on the ground and used his spit mixed with sand and put it on the face of the young boy. And instantly he asked him to go and wash at the pool of Siloam. And instantly he received his tithe. That is the Jesus Christ. We talking about that power still exists if you believe you will experience it so never you doubt the efficacy of jesus christ it is you and me losing our vim losing our faith in god the power of jesus christ has never re re reduced yes 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 look at the blind Bartimaeus. oh my god hey Bartimaeus was started crying and shouting when jesus was passing by and and the disciples were trying to push him back but jesus said bring him here and jesus asked him what do you want me to do for you and blind Bartimaeus responded rabboni rabbi teacher i want to receive my sight oh my god lord jesus christ who remained the same yesterday and today to and tomorrow and for Jesus Christ restored the sight of a blind Bartimaeus. What a miracle. Oh my God. What about salvation seekers? Hey, Sarkios, the tax collector, knowing well that Jesus Christ is the Savior who can save his life. He saw, he saw himself as a sinner and he wanted salvation. He climbed the sycamore tree and Jesus beckoned on him, come down, Sarkios. Today, salvation has entered your house. He followed Sarkios to the house because the mission of our Lord Jesus Christ, he came to seek and to find those who were lost. On that day, Sarkios and his household were saved. They received the blind Bartimaeus, received his sight. Sarkios, the sinner, was saved. My God, Jesus came to save. He just came and one of the weapons he used for salvation, giving us peace and joy, miracle. 
He saved people for the purpose of salvation. Hallelujah. Zacchaeus was saved. What about, the, what about Nicodemus? Nicodemus was a, was, was a member of a Jewish ruling council. He was a very wealthy man. He came to Jesus at night and my Jesus told him in a, in, a, in a plain language, my friend, you have to be born again. Jesus came before Nicodemus had a encounter with Jesus. He was unsaved. But after his encounter with Jesus, he received divine salvation. That is the mission of our Jesus Christ. His mission is still relevant to modern day life. He remained the same. He changed none. He has come to save you and me. If not for the sake and the grace of Jesus Christ, in somebody in, in, in my life, where will I be today? He saved my life. He rescued me from death five times in my life. And he gave me, he changed my life and he gave me the make awakening mandate without this saving grace. Where will I be? It is that saving grace that heal you, that deliver you, that save your life. So he remained the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. Proclaim it, elogize it, tell it to the old world, preach it to the old nations. He, Jesus says, I have come to seek and to find those who are lost. He changed not. His ministry is still relevant to modern day life. It is you and me who have lost the vim. It is you and me who have lost the faith. It is you and me who have failed in our duty to propagate the real, the ideal message of Jesus Christ. Let us wake up right now with the awakening spirit and go to the entire world and preach the gospel of salvation and bring the lost soul unto Christ because our Jesus Christ remained the same yesterday, today and forever. There are real miracles, real miracles that come from Look at Mary Magdalene. You know how many demons that woman was possessed with. And she was brought to Jesus Christ, hey, on the allegation that he committed adultery. But merciful Father, merciful God, he had passion on her. And Jesus delivered her and she became a vessel unto honor in the Jesus Christ ministry. What is your mission on earth, my brother? What are we doing? Jesus Christ did not preach because of money. Jesus Christ did not preach because of fame. Jesus Christ did not preach because of private jail. Jesus Christ did not preach and save soul because... Yes, Jesus did not preach because of earthly acquisition. Therefore, my dear brother and sister, listen to the sound of my voice. Let us go back to the origin and purpose and mission of our Lord Jesus Christ. Let the church arise and proclaim the true message of salvation. Believe in him. And trust in Jesus Christ. His power is still the same. He can use you. He can use me to do wonders. Never you mix the power of Jesus Christ with the power of Satan. Never you allow unbeliever to talk evil about our Jesus Christ. Because he remained the same. Because Jesus remained the same. And I stepped him into my life. And I see him as my Lord and Savior. I am saved. Because Jesus remained the same yesterday, today and forever. And I accept him and I believe into my life. I am blessed. Because Jesus remained the same forever. Yesterday, today, forever, and I appropriate him in my life, and I have faith in him. My life. I am victorious, and I'm covered in his precious blood. I believe in his death and resurrection. He died for the remission of my sins, and he saved me and took away my pain and my agony. He, he, he paid the price on the cross of Calvary, and I accept him into my life, and he remains. Yes. Don't look at your pastor. Don't look at what he's doing. Don't look at your bishop. Don't look at your archbishop. Don't look at that leader. Don't look at that elder. Look at the cross. Because if you look at your pastor, you look at archbishop, you look at all, you look at the wealth of your pastor, you look at the private jet, your faith in Christ may go down. Look at the cross. Don't look at your pastor. Your pastor is a human being. He is called to teach you and to direct you. You yourself, you've got the grace to study the scripture and do the right thing. A lot of things is happening in Christendom now. Yes, a lot of things is happening nowadays. You Christians listen to the sound of my voice. Be careful. Don't use your mouth to blaspheme. As we have fake doctors, as we have fake nurses, as we have fake teachers, as we have fake politicians, we also, as we have fake businessmen and 419 businessmen, we also have fake pastors. And that does not mean... We should denigrate the ministry of Jesus Christ. Let us be careful by what we say, by what we do, and my Jesus will bless you. But I have come to assure you, you listening to the sound of my voice, Jesus will never fail you. In your business, he will never fail you. In your education, he will never fail you. In your health, he will never fail you because he remained the same. And he continued to rule. Today, I want you to reaffirm this statement of faith in your life. Say it after me. Jesus Christ remain the savior of the whole world. Jesus Christ remain the creator of of the universe. Jesus Christ remain the head of the church. 
Jesus Christ remain your father, your mentor, your healer, your deliverer, and your provider. Jesus Christ remain your all in all. He changeth not. Jesus Christ remains your life. Without him, you have no life. Jesus Christ remain your future. Without him, you have no future. Jesus Christ remain everything is your husband, is your everything, is your father. Jesus Christ remain the creator of the universe. Hold on to this. Never you allow what you hear and what you see. Never you allow the behavior of your pastor, behavior of that prophet, behavior of that leader to make you lower your love for God. Don't be discouraged. My Jesus remain the same yesterday and forevermore because, because of him, you are blessed. Yes, I leave you with this, my song. Yes, and I will want you ensure that you get your copy. You get a copy of I Am Blessed. Yes, this is I Am Blessed, my latest music online. You can get, you can download this music on bishop peter kayode dash my shopifycom I want my children listening to me to type it on the on the screen right now. bishop peter kayode my shopify.com buy this music it will increase your faith in god it will show you that jesus is the same yesterday forever he changed yes download this music on this platform bishop dash peter dash coyote dash dot my shopify.com also this is my book autobiography you need to know a lot about this man preaching to you. I've seen a lot in life. I have escaped death five times. Get this, my autobiography. He watches over me at the same platform. Bishop dash Peter Carody dash dot my Shopify dot com. You don't forget download the music online and my autobiography. He watches over me. Jesus remained the same yesterday, today, and forever. He watches over you. Get them at bishop dash peter dash coyote dash falarubon dot my shopify dot com. My name is Bishop Peter Coyote Falarubon. I want to tell you, Jesus remained the same yesterday, today, and forever. Let your face rise. is with you all the days of your life. Enjoy this music. Yes, look at me well, well. Yes, that's the music. Sing it along. Get your copy. Yes, Bishop Peter dash Coyote dash Falanubon dot my shop dot com. And he watches over me. Come on, sing it. I am blessed. Hey, come on, let's go. Jesus remained the same yesterday. Today and forever. Hey, don't look down on me, don't look down on me, don't look down on me. Let's go. Don't look down on me, don't look down on me. Hey, oh, I am blessed. I am blessed. Oh, yes, I'm blessed. What about you? Join me. Join me. Hey, man. Hey. Yes, don't look down on me, don't look down on me, don't look down. Get your copy of that song, download it online, myshopify.com. And he watches over me. Come on. How? Yes. Come on. Uh. She remained the same. Yes, my brother, you are blessed.